Hey, thanks for joining me. Travis from the Knife Joker. Today, well, really just, we got new hats in and new shirts and I thought, well, we didn't make an announcement. I was looking around for maybe that, that model, that model person to really get a million views and 400,000 likes. But anyway, yeah, just, just me and the new shirts. Um, Overall, yeah, they came out pretty nice. So I thought I might as well show them. Oh, I don't know. Uh, probably make enough videos and show enough. Um, Bishop is, well, yeah, Bishop, California. We're out in the middle of, uh, just say we're out in the middle of nowhere. Um, they have to really make it a destination to come here. So might as well put a few of these things online. And I realize when I'm making these videos, I think the... <laughs> Trying to say, um, I always look over here, but the camera's over here. So I have to get used to that anyway. But yeah, the new hats came in. Um, yeah, that green and purple thing going on. And oh yeah, we did, well, I've made them once before. Here's the old, one of the old ones just for grins. Um, probably the original, I guess. The original one in the golden. A lavender, really purple. But beyond that, the new ones, I don't know what to say. Oh, yeah, I'm fe making a feature video of the hats. You know, Flex Fit and um, what are these 100% polyester or something. So they're, uh, you can see through them a little bit. It's supposed to be like cool and dry. But yeah, they're pretty cool. And right now it's pretty dry because I'm not outside. Maybe 100 degrees out there. It might not be so dry if I was out there. We'll see. But yeah, these have been pretty nice. Um, the new shirts. Well, I don't know. I should have be filming somebody walking down the walk, the runway with one. But yeah, uh, we took off that dot com if you ever saw the old ones. Um, some of the old heads. The old, say the Knife Joker old heads have some of those old shirts. All these new era, boy, where are they? New era, um, yeah, here's the tag. Well, not a tag, a tagless tag. Not the best shot. Should have somebody to film that, zoom in on the back of my head there, but those new era tagless tag, um, these worked out pretty well. Have this over, I'm not, I'm not a closed salesman person. Well, I'm not, um, not, not Jim Skelton either, so my sales pitch is a little bit off. It's got this overrolled shoulder here. I mean, just saying, it makes it fit pretty well. And then uh, the back, yeah, the KJ, and it's our, I guess, what do you call it? Slogan. I always forget that word. Slogan. Yeah, yeah, I guess that's our company slogan. I always think motto, but it's not a motto, it's a slogan. I remember the word on camera. And, you know, just that Bishop California thing. Seems like, yeah, since we are a destination, like a vacation point, everybody always wants something. So there's Bishop California on it, so there they are. And if you're from here or come through, hopefully you could see. It's a spray of our mountains here. Um, but yeah, I don't know who did that. Let's see. Uh, if you leave a comment, did that logo come out a little crook? Is it crooked or is it straight? Somebody said they always put the logos on your sleeve a little crooked because when you're standing there, you know, your arm's not like back here or I don't know. So if you want to leave a comment on, is that crooked or is that straight? I mean, in all reality, I think it's just, it's a couple degrees off. But yeah, if you're, if you're cruising around, may, maybe you don't notice. Or maybe it's just dead on. I've never, any screen printers? Uh, I think that's what you call them. Any shirt guys uh, watching this video? You can comment on the comments and say, yeah, it's done right. Oh, and then I'm not a screen guy, but I guess these are thermal. These are, this is screen printing and these are thermal, I think. So, 
let's see what else is going on uh, while we're here. Oh, I keep getting these new knives and should probably make a new video every day. Uh, it'd be nice to see these more up in person. These are, is this one a weasel? I think they're weasel. Um, oh, it's a little, what do you call it? Slip joint, double detent slip joint by Concept Knives. So yeah, I better start making a video every day or at least one a week. Try to catch up on a couple of these. Uh, yeah, just a slip joint, but pretty cool. Just really quick, yeah, here, oh, this one's, I think, a Fusa, the same type of thing. But um, Concept continues to oh, make some pretty cool knives. That, that green my car is actually green. So many green my cars look brown, and of course the brown looks like tan or poop. But, uh, well, I like Micarta, don't get me wrong, but when you get a green Micarta, it, it, it almost, oh, it never looks green. Um, just these were just sitting here. Just uh, a sipiter. Uh, well, the front flippers seem to be just taken off. And, um, well, there's that a sipiter from Concept. I don't even have it up on the site yet. So, <laughs> better put it up on the site before I create too much excitement. Um, but yeah, but we're putting these up on the site and finally got the acipiter in hand there and good God. oh my, oh, sorry. I got I think it, I shouldn't point it up so much because the gravity just, it's going to cut my hand, cut my thumb off. I guess not. It hits your, your thumbnail. It, it, oh yeah. Hit my thumbnail. I don't need to get scared, but man, they did a good job on that. It's fun to play with. Yeah, it is. Mini acipiter. See if I can show that carbon fiber. Of course, it's focused on my face. Maybe it, I never do videos facing myself if you watch the channel. I feel like I want to get out of here. But no, just showing these super quick. It's not, not a knife review. Do the knife reviews here soon. Um, mini occipiter focused on my face the whole time. So let's get this over with. The mini occipiter is pretty. I mean, all these new knives that came out from Concept Hand. Just the finishes and the looks. So many different ones. That's all. Just excited about that. Um, I like. Maybe I like these colors better than the original ones. I don't know. I mean, I didn't really pick out the original ones. They were. My buddy made them for me, and uh, it was pretty, pretty great. What else is going on? I'm just looking around. Oh, uh, last thing, I guess, before I get off this rambling video. Maybe I should just call this a rambling video. Um, now, these should be coming out next week, these little jesters. You know, the, the ladybug does have the same handle as the jester now. Um, of course, you could say it the other way around. The jester has the ladybug handle. The ladybug, ha you know, whatever. Little glow in the dark. Chester, I love, I love that tip jumping, personally. The way it fits in your hand like that. A little locking knife for your keychain, and these do glow in the dark. And in addition, are let's see, this is not going to work. That is not going to work. Twenty CV. I'll just say that. Maybe it says it on the box, and it does not. So you'll have to trust me on this one. They're 20 CV, won't focus on it. Doesn't say it on the box. I might say it in the paperwork there for Spider Co. So the rambling video is almost over. Um, I think these jesters will, hopefully Spider Co community will be pretty happy to have them. I've wanted one for at least five years. And uh, you, you, you can find stuff on the, secondhand market and so forth, but just requested to have these made and waited patiently, patiently, patiently. And now here they come. So I guess I'm gonna call it just our first look. Probably rambling video, <laughs> probably a better name, but I'll do a video hopefully looking down at these knives and not my face here soon. 
So thanks for checking out these new era. Oh, I didn't show the the, um, the tag down here. There's, it's got that, even that tag down at the bottom and the new era logo on the inside. So, I mean, geez, if they were uh, Nike shirts, they'd probably be 60 bucks or something like that. Um, yeah, these ones are, I, I'd say, medium price shirts, new era shirts. What do they make a lot of um, a sports, a lot of sports stuff? I can do a quick pocket dump. Let's see what's there. Let's see what's in there. Riot K1. Yeah, unplanned. <laughs> Did not carry this for the video, but I mean, that's what's in my pocket today. That Riot K1. So probably one of my, well, maybe my favorite knife. One of my favorite knives. Can't be too choosy today. I don't want to narrow it down too much. All right, well, if you like we see, please hit that subscribe button and otherwise uh, hit the bell, they say. We'll see you next time. As I look over here and the camera's over there. We'll work on that. See you next time.